What's up, y'all? It's Questionable Reality, and today we're at the Lunchbox filming episode number 25. Across from me, I got my boy Chan. I got my boy Shy, a part of J3 Mob um, music yes, music group collective. You feel me? Um, Sipping on drain, but that's just a stand. The water volcano feel like it's the moon. I've been ocean fishing, caught a shark out the blue. I don't bother little yeah from my bro he a Jew. In a party with gang bitches, jump in the pool. I tell it off for the gang. So I'm just going to let Chan hop in real quick just because we got two of you guys. I want you just to little, give a little bit of um, information about, you know, what you do, film the type of music that you make because, you know, like I said, we got two artists, J3 Mob, collective group. Uh, me and Shy, we make music together. We go by J3 Mob. We also make solo music. We have a collective called Planet Smiley Records. has like 10, 15 artists. Um, me and Shy, I'd say we make like, fast-paced hip-hop most of the time but we're pretty versatile with it we like to keep it versatile i, I got you yeah, we slow it keep down. the versatility there yeah i say shion he's he's been on like a way more calm vibe like he's been trying to hit those like plug beats and stuff like he's been trying to find Not that as pocket. much right now but okay I facts just chill. i feel it i feel it so where um so where are you guys originally from so uh, i mean i grew up in like northridge area Northridge, like the valley, like California, like, but I know, like, it's like LA area. area, LA area type shit. So, so yeah, so for everybody listening, you feel me? LA area, you know, hip hop music, fast paced. Um, you know, like they said, though, versatile with it. Um, yeah, nah. So, like you were saying, Shy's getting into some plug beats. So, I mean, like, just are more you more chill shit, like ambient shit, just like hella vibey stuff. I got you, spacey stuff. Just like trying to find night, his own some pocket, night, some nighttime shit, like. Okay, so like roll up a J in the car type. Yes, okay, like roll up a J, smoke that shit by yourself. You know, like I just, feel it. Yeah, just Shy, Shy can take that like what plug music or like whatever people are doing with whatever beats. You know, like we're using. He can take that. Like I be focused more at least on like the last year. Like we we change our music standpoint, like what we're making every month. But like okay. for the total of the year, I'd say I was more on like aggressive fast pace he was trying to get that like it, it's like a certain pocket like he's taking like he's trying to find like he's trying to find it like how me and sebi were kind of talking in the last podcast he's trying to find his shy like, like i'm taking yeah. what i fuck with and what i like to listen and i'm making my own little mixture of it to where i think i think this fits perfectly out there and i can really get a little spot in this and people would want to be okay oh, fuck i want to get on that shit you okay know? i, I fuck with better. that yeah so just trying to find like your own unique like path within this kind of yeah. obstructed music fucking oh, scene that's going on right now. Nah, I fuck with it, definitely. So, um, from Northridge, so that's, like, more, like, northern L.A. for all you guys listening. So, like, what was y'all's childhood, like, growing up? Was it more, mu did you guys have, like, any background in music? Like, did anything kind of drive no this, what's going on right now? No musical background. <laughs> my, my dad, he was, um, he was a radio station host when he oh, was, word? Like 21. But other than that, no, no music. Just, like, a lot of music appreciation. Like, I grew up pretty much just, like, straight reggae in the house. And then... That's that's different. Yeah. That's yeah. different. My dad, I don't know why, like, what drove him to that, but... Does your dad he, smoke weed? No, nah, he never he doesn't? did. No. Nah. He didn't, but I would go to his house every day after school in high school, and every day would be bumping... He would be, like, bumping that <laughs> yeah. reggae shit loud as fuck. He had some Jamaican flowing through his, his body. Dude, Pato Bonton, he's like, yeah. I don't know how valid he actually is in the reggae scene, but he's a goat in fucking my eyes. Type but shit. I mean, shit, everybody has their idols. We went to me? his concert with his dad, too. Like, mm -hmm. we pulled up in, like, in like Topanga or some shit, and we saw him live, and he was just a mad chill dude. Like, he showed love after the show and everything. He was just good vibes all around. It was crazy to see, like, that different uh, aspect of music. Nice as far as folk. So, growing up, reggae background kind of i'm not, i mean like uh, yeah i'd say because you said it's playing all throughout the house as yeah, you're growing up just so like whatever was in the house he had like one cd that like I, he didn't really know how stuff worked he just had one cd that constantly played for fucking like four years like <laughs> some time he woke up time he went to sleep so like and the reason i'm asking this um just for everybody watching and listening um i just want to get a feel for you know what you know kind of inspired you know like ice soup and shit like that now that we're hearing oh, but yeah. 
Yeah, so reggae background, you know what I mean? So, like, was there any type of, like, hip-hop? Like, because reggae is, you know, its own type of hip-hop in yeah, my eyes. There, There is, like, like some or, hip-hop in, in, in reggae. But I, for the hip-hop types of you, like, just growing up in L.A., like, California, just being a kid, like, even just the radio, if you're not in L.A., like, you're, you're, you're the radio <laughs> is mostly just, like, Hip hop bangers. From when I was our age, it was like Wayne, Eminem, like Nicki Minaj, Drake type shit. I mean, stuff. for me, I was in fucking Maryland, so like our radio, st- our our radio stations were cool. Like you feel me? It played like y'all probably had like the shit as soon as it hit the scene, though. You know what I mean? Yeah, like yeah. going through the radio. So no, nah, I definitely feel that. So you mean so I, so you guys had um, we're getting a little bong action. You feel me? <laughs> um, but yeah, nah. So uh, early influence through. Hip hop, reggae, you know, your dad's playing shit throughout the house. Yeah, my dad You're used to bump fucking like Michael Jackson all the time and shit. Type that's so that's what your pops was on. So you had more like the the groovy type yeah, of like, swat. I mean everything too. Like exactly what he's saying with the radio. Definitely like I was all radio and shit. Like I was just like like just like I feel like a normal kid, you know? So do y'all remember when Soldier Boy came out? Or y'all don't remember that? My I sisters. wasn't too tapped. My sister I was like the baby of the family, so um I was I was born when my brothers and sisters were all in high school, so they were fucking heavy with so- Soldier Boy. Yeah, I was about to say because yeah. the radio and shit. I was like, because that fool like had that whole thing on lock. You feel me? And then you know the whole beginning of social media and whatnot. No, they had me as a kid like doing the fucking dances and stuff, and, like putting on glasses. <laughs> I was just like their fucking puppet. It was funny hitting the fucking <laughs> Superman and shit, bro. <laughs> I'm over here drinking water with both hands like a fucking I don't even know like a villager. <laughs> What you got planned for 2025? What's his name? What's that little Steve? guy's name? The little guy's name? That you, Mercer? My, my fucking <laughs> <nephew>. <laughs> <laughs> Mercer, you well, should. I have a baby net, my, 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 my <laughs> brother's son. He said, what's that little dude you be hanging with? Like, yo, you're wild. That's but, crazy as fuck. Why don't you put shit on him? Why don't you get Mercer right and get it right? Yeah. <laughs> for the gram, for like what the is gram. he talking about, bro? For everybody <laughs> listening, I right. this decipher what Shy just said. Everybody, please. Um, they say they used to dress you up like Soldier Boy, right? Okay, yeah. When, I, when like, I was like four and five, this kid is like yeet. one and a half. We have yeet now. Just looking like <laughs> some dumb shit. Like, oh <laughs> no, that's I see <laughs> what you're saying now. Right, I'm seeing what you're saying now. They would look at Chan and say, "Chandler, leave this house." Like, no, this. Not it. <laughs> I think it is it. I'm feeling what you're saying now. That's some viral <laughs> shit right there. That's just some funny shit, bro. If it was my kid, I would. <clears throat> but yeah, not to digress off of the fucking the music and everything. So, um, yeah. So, goddamn it. So, when did when did you guys start making music? Then, if it you know if it wasn't really like a major drive, you know, like growing up. So, like, when did it become like an interest to you guys? COVID, like when COVID hit, I was all like, everybody was trying to stay inside, but I was like. Bro, like, I gotta, like... We gotta pop out and get this Yeah, morning. I was in the <laughs> studio and shit, and everyone was like, are you sure, like, you're good? And I was like, bro, Stay why would I not us. be in the studio right now? Why would I sit at home doing nothing? Like, And I, like, I didn't want to do any more online school because, like, bro, it's so fucking, like... I, I'm in my room. I'm not trying to do school, bro. It's hard it wasn't. for me. Like, I have, like, ADHD. I'm ADHD as fuck, bro. I can like, see it. I'm not trying to just sit <laughs> in my room. I'm like, bro, I'd rather play the Xbox. Like, I would rather just go and do shit and create shit. And, like, I was, I like, feel it. Bro, I couldn't so, hug my mom for, like... Yeah, almost a year because I chose to go to the studio and her like my stepdad is like he's like in his 70s like he's kind of old so we couldn't risk that shit so I was like look I can't just take a back seat in life for this whole fucking thing like you guys just have to stay in your part and I'll stay in my part let me just like get mine just stay away from me like, I feel I, it I can get sick damn so y'all so that's how damn so that's how it was like Damn, and my like my family, bro, like, cause I have like a young mom, so like I don't I don't know, like it was like a complete different mindset, like, bro, shoot, I don't give a fuck, like you can go out, you know, do whatever you want to do. Like I never got, co- I didn't even get COVID, you know what I mean, until like yeah. a year and a mom's half after like COVID happened. Word, yeah, my mom's a nurse, so she had to like work and stuff too. So I'm like, she's already kind of doing her thing, and yeah. she's not, she doesn't want me to go. She wouldn't want me to go, go ape shit, dumb shit. Like, yeah, yeah, that yeah, that's what she's my- like going. Like, do your shit. Yeah, that's what my mom was saying. She was like, don't fucking, you know, like, you don't have to just fucking yeah. hunker up inside of yeah. here. You know, you can go out, but, like, yeah. don't go fucking just let people and, cough in your mouth type And there was shit. just, like, a few people I would see. Like, I had, like, 
Jacob. I would go to Jacob's house like every other day in like the morning and just smoke with him. And he was 20 minutes away and go, fuck, the, free is em- the freeway is empty, bro. It's like, fuck it. Head Literally. Out. Empty, just empty GTA smoke, lobby, bro. Go fuck smoke, it. go to the dispensary, whatever, like. That's so funny that, like, fucking literally everything got shut down, but dispensaries were essential businesses, bro. Yeah, that's <laughs> like, crazy. Oh, God. Everyone like, was there in their masks and like, shit. Like, what the fuck, bro? Like, we're all going to smoke weed when there's a fuck. But to be honest, like, this whole entire, like, because I don't agree with what happened with the, um, you know, this is a little bit off topic from music, but we'll definitely bounce back in. But I definitely don't agree with, um, you know, what how everything happened with the whole COVID situation. You know, everybody has their own opinions. You know, mm-hmm. it's okay to have your own opinion. Yeah. But yeah, no, I definitely feel like it was handled in a, you know, a crazy way. But, you know, we what were... Would you, what would you have done? To be honest, I can't give an answer of what I would have done, but you know what no, I like mean? Like, I feel the same. I feel the same fucking way. I'm just like, what what part of it? So... Just like the, the shutdown or... It was it was basically the lockdown and then, you know, just and the lockdown causing all our people to lose their businesses and lose money and shit like that. That's what I thought was. Um, that's true. That's what I thought was kind of stupid because oh, yeah. uh, it directly impacted, you know, not my family, but some people that I know that own small businesses mm-hmm. and shit. So that was kind of sad to see that happen. And, you know, even, you know, like now you can go down the street in downtown L.A., you know, fucking I was just listening to a podcast with um joe rogan they were explaining like um you know how skid row was actually becoming you know lo- not skid row my bad i'm so sorry downtown la was low-key becoming like gentrified and shit like that and then covid hit and it took out all the small businesses and shit that you know were actually getting put in place so now yeah. it's like back at square zero yeah shit's fucked bro yeah <laughs> la is fucked yeah and then you still see like fucking <coughs> weird propaganda and shit so i don't fucking know i don't really care but i you know yeah, it definitely, it definitely stemmed a lot of weird shit. It definitely, like, made me look at everything a little differently. Just because, like, you saw how you saw how certain people moved in in COVID, like... That's like, facts, I, bro. I, I Some people even, went crazy, dude. Like, literally, yeah. like, it's... And that's kind of what I was, like, talking about, like, with the whole LA scene. I was like... Blame anybody for doing that shit. Exactly, and that's and that's where I where I was at, like with the I I don't know what I could change, cause you know what I mean. At the end of the day, that shit was, it was literally like one day we got a fucking you know notification. And it was like, all right, it's gonna be two weeks, you know, and that was random as fuck. And we're like, okay, two weeks, and then after the the middle of the second week or the first week, it was like, okay, this is gonna be, you know. Yeah, I so, got to be thankful. Yeah, who I knows? Be thankful for it, because if that shit never happened, I would not be where I'm at. Because me and Shy were both in school when COVID happened. <laughs> it was literally just, oh, okay, we're off of school this week. That's then, we wouldn't have we wouldn't have taken music seriously if COVID never happened. Oh God, like, I swear to God, I yeah. was getting good ass grades randomly in college. Like, <laughs> I was not good in shit. Like growing up and shit, I was like, eh, so and so, it's whatever. Like I was slack off. I'd fucking hate homework, but. Yeah. That's how I, I was homework. So fucking. much homework, and it's like at the end of the yeah, homework just fucks you, bro. It's like nobody's trying to go home and do that shit, but it's like. And I, I was a bad I tester too. I, I was good at the test. That's what I'm saying. I learned the shit because I fuck with going like to school. I was like seeing my friends and shit. I'm like, all right, it's not the. And I'm you weren't just being a shit. dumbass. You were actually like obtaining the shit. Yeah, that they yeah were so speaking. I'm learning what's up. I'm just not doing the homework. I'm <laughs> like, all right, I got like an 86 on the test, bro. Like it's clear that I know what the fuck is going on. Like 90 percent, whatever. Like you know, like it's like. What the fuck was I even just talking about, bro? You're talking about COVID. the homework and how this shit kind of... Yeah. The 80... But in college, yeah, but I was actually... Uh, college, I, like, locked in. Because I was like, this is my life, bro. I have to lock in, right? Yep. And we're making music a little bit on the side. Like, whenever we could link... He was going to Santa Monica, and I'm out in Moore Park, bro. It's, like, two different sides of the fucking map. So it's, like, we only could sometimes link on the weekends and shit. It was weird. So uh, it was, like, whenever the fuck y'all could actually do that shit. Yeah, but we had like, never been to the studio ever before when we were in, in school. Like, it was just, like, oh, we're gonna go in the backseat of this car on fucking GarageBand and we're gonna make a fucking hit. But it's, like, it was not, like, the best of the shit. It was obviously some bullshit. Ass. But it was ass as fuck. But, but it was like, the we beginning. We were having fun. Yeah. Yeah, so then we, like, we're, like, okay, we can actually do something if we lock the fuck in, bro. Like, we just have to take it serious. So basically, so what I'm hearing, the start of J3 Mob was, you know, just you guys, COVID came, fucking, it was like, you know, what else are we going to do? We're going to fucking sit around and, you know, just, you know, dicks. exactly, you know what I mean? Fucking play Xbox and spank our meat, like, the fuck, <laughs> are we going to go do some shit? Yeah. So now nah, I fuck with the, you know, the driving shit, the mentality that, you know, kind of switched when shit got real, you know what I mean? You guys locked in because, you know, now you guys are in a... Way yeah. better position, you know what I mean? If you guys are, then if you guys were just, you know, like dropping music here and there, you know what I mean? Oh, yeah, it also, no, it also, like, most importantly, no. it forced us to learn how, or first, at least me, Sean knows how to mix it, his, his music to a certain extent, but 
we know how to make our music ourselves now but before we literally didn't, like i know how to mix like completely now but we like we used to go to engineers every single time and like have to pay somebody to fucking do exactly. some shit for you nobody, yeah bro nobody's yeah, they don't give a fuck because yeah, no, it's like nobody's ever why would you? It's yeah like, i mean and especially during like the the because like you said you guys started during covid like bro there was <laughs> fucking people like that like i swear to god bro like Yes, yeah, scamming and shit was, you know, popping before COVID, but my boy, like, and it's not saying that, you feel me, like, but the care level of right anybody COVID doing, peaked. exactly, the care the level of anybody doing anything on the internet was so fucking low from features to fucking, you know, like, everybody was just trying to do some fucking, not everybody, but a lot of the fucking Everyone music was scene. trying to get bread. Nobody exactly. Get a job. Was- and, you know, that plays a big part of it too, bro, and, you know, fucking... You know, that is a big factor, and it fucking COVID hit, and nobody had money because you couldn't get a fucking job, you're right. So, I I mean, yeah. No, nah, and then, like you said, people aren't putting in the best work when you are paying them and shit, so that's just fucking trash. But yeah, fact. I, was, I was literally getting to something right before I got into this. I'm, I'm burnt. If this shit blows up and it has a lot of views, I would tell any artist, learn how to fucking mix your own songs. And learn, oh, that's learn what how to Learn how to get your own computer, get an Apollo, get a mic. Learn how to just set up in your room and just learn how to do it yourself because no engineer that's not you is going to give you the time and care that you give about your song. That's facts, and bro. And you'll get so much better just off of learning how to mix. You'll be like, oh, damn, if I do this, I could make this sound and it'll sound yeah. crazy. And you don't have to just go and do it in two hours. You have like, okay, I could work on this song today. I can make it in an hour. I can make it in 30 minutes or I can make it in two weeks. It's like however you want it. That's real shit, bro. You literally like... You can craft, like, exactly what the fuck you want. You know what it's I mean? You can take like, a year if you, you want to. You can just make your shit whenever <laughs> you want, bro. Whenever you want, just find a spot you can plug in. Like, all I need is two plugs and I'm good. Like, Facts. At, and the at more the point I'm at, if I could do it in my car right now, I would. I just don't have the plugs. It's, like, unfortunate. <laughs> I feel it. And it's, like, <laughs> like you guys are saying, it's, like, the more you are learning, like, it's, like, I'm going to say it again, bro. It's like you can literally, you don't have to be like, oh, man, how is he making that sound? How is it sound? It's like you literally are fucking three years down the road after you've been doing it. You're like, okay, I know this. I know how to revert. You know, I don't know too much about recording because I'm not a recording yeah. artist. But, um, yeah. It is. It's that way. Yeah. yeah. Um, but, yeah, no, nah, what I was saying, what I said I forgot to say, though, is, um, and I, what the fuck? I just forgot it. Oh, yeah, no, we filmed this podcast before, guys. So if you hear me say, like, yeah, I know, or some shit to, like, something that Chan or Shy says, and it's like, how the fuck did you know that? It's like, because we, we are having to refilm this. My dog ate the fucking SD card. Shout out Q. Yep, Q's laying on the ground right now, just full of memory. <laughs> but, yeah, not nah, so. Bro's homework got eaten by the dog. Yeah, no cap. So, <laughs> yeah, this is, the, this is this is getting refilmed. So, like I said, if you hear me saying... Oh yeah, I know. Or some some like they're like, oh yeah, yeah. Just you know, we talked about this before, so. Yeah, yeah. But, but um, we, we shot that at like two months, two months ago. Like, yeah, yeah. We got a fair amount of new shits happened since. Hell yeah, ninety percent of what we talked about is new. But just, there's a few things that I just I might have said, and it's like <laughs> people might have questioned it. But to hop back into the music and shit, so we got through, you know, a little bit of the upbringing. You know how you guys started, um, you know, making music separately, um, so. Now COVID is starting to end. You know what I mean? You guys have been making music for a little while now. Shit's starting to open back up. You know, when did J3 Mob become, like, a intertwined thing? Like, you know what I mean? It had always been a thing. We made our that first was the, song we didn't have solo, together. We yeah. didn't start with solo music. We started with, like, J3 Mob shit. And so that was, the, that was the beginning. Was Y'all guys yeah. always had an idea just to, like, let's just do this shit together. Yeah, there was Must never see, a yeah. song that I made that he didn't get on or vice versa for, like, the first, like, year. Okay, facts. Well, that's, that's new. It was, no, it that's fire. Like that's what we did. It was, it was more of just, like, like We've mostly recently hobby. been getting into the solo bag. That's what I was about to say. So now, so... To reverse that question, so COVID's ending. Um, you guys are now starting to branch off and find your own, like, you know, your own sounds and shit. So during that time, like, is any, like, have did you guys have any shows? Like, are any promoters hitting you up? Uh, you know what I mean? Anything of that nature? Or are you guys still just, you know, doing your daily, you know, making music, dropping it, promoting it? We've honestly taken a back seat from shows right now. We're trying to just, like, hit that next level before yeah but like even. i we did hella shows through covid and like right after covid but then like since this last like year year and a half yeah we've been like 
just, just stacking up content. Yeah, we're trying to we've just get, been grinding yeah. the more of the work rather than just make anything on a lit beat and go out and perform it. We've been no, like, that's right, good. Now it's like that's smart. Lock the fuck in. That's the smart way to do it because you know, we, like, we still make our connections and shit, but for sure, we're just not like performing and not like asking or hitting people up and doing anything random like that. Yeah, no, nah, and that makes sense because, like, you know, <laughs> like we were talking about before, like, you know, how everybody's trying to find their own little, like, not their own little, but their own way of doing shit within, you know, even myself. Mm. But, like, like you yeah, guys said, that shit comes into play, bro, you know, just fucking doing some shit real quick, dropping it, trying to perform it. Like, everyone's doing that, bro. You know what yeah. I mean? If you just, like, like you guys are already on it because you just said it. You know, if you just take a little bit of time, you know what I mean, and fucking, yeah, no, you know what I mean, just it's still fun. Exactly, like, it's, yeah. It's like, it's just, you know, it's just working on the craft, right? And we've been working on the craft, but and it feels a little bit more like, I don't know, I don't know. It's like it's not just like bullshit. It feels like a little bit more like, okay, bet, like you feel me? We got a little yeah. goal. We're finna boom, 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 and then this is finna happen. All right, mm. so I don't know, but um, yeah, nah, you guys can continue. I just had to put that in there. You're good. 2025 we got big, we got big shit coming honestly nah it's good so to from the shows the um the from the shows during covid and a little bit after covid like you said so you guys are now dropping motherfucking albums you guys got shit out hella fucking your discography is you know what i mean for everybody watching we'll just put a song right here that's what's going on right now, though. Yeah. But yeah, so um, albums dropping. Y'all, y'all got dope ass singles dropping. So, Chan, I want to just like focus on you a little bit, just because Chan is Chan's the Chan's music or his solo music. I've been people more recently in Shy's music. Not to say that these guys are both doing amazing shit within the fucking you know music scene, but um, like I said, focus on Chan for just two seconds. Mm-hmm. Um, just some of the new music that you're dropping. You know what I mean? I kind of want to get a feel of, like, what your headspace is when you go into the studio. You know what I mean? Because we already talked about the shit prior. You feel me? We yeah. talked about all that good stuff. So, like, what's your headspace now when you enter the studio? Right now, honestly, I've just been trying to make... Like, when I start the song, or step back, when I pick the beat, I'm trying to think of something that I can make like a trailer or a TikTok too that I know I can just put a good hook down cuz like I know I can make a good song but right now I just have to lock in on these like 10 second hooks the catchy shit that's going to yeah. draw in the cuz I I posted I've been posting these trailers like as Instagram reels making some connections that way and I feel like that's a good way to go and then I just need to focus more on making actual Instagram reel like content with it instead of just dancing or whatever. No, I feel it. I mean, the dancing school too. Trailers you know what I mean? The dancing are all hard school. As fuck. Yeah, I fuck with it. You know what I mean? And it's like, thank you. Um, yeah, <laughs> those the Instagram reels that you're talking about and stuff. All this shit means something though. At the end mm. of the day, because like you said, you need to post more of them, and that's definitely true. Because bro, a fucking Instagram reel in a day can get like 4k views, 5k views, and that's not. Like the most insane to the top people posting getting millions, but like yeah, bro, that's that definitely like a hundred k easy, bro. Exactly, you know what I mean. And imagine you like there's you know that fucking viral post. It's like I only have five likes, but imagine if five, bro. Imagine if fucking five thousand people walked in. You know what I mean? Those people actually saw you, so yeah. it's real people. You yeah, know what I mean? Facts. These connections are real, which is you know it's a good thing that you're doing that. So I I definitely fuck with it. I agree with it. Um, we recently, we locked in with Flyboy Tarantino. He was another member in, in Members Only. Type shit? Yeah, and he was, like, one of our biggest inspirations, too, just Members Only and, like, the whole, the whole Florida collective. scene. I told yeah. you at the first interview, like, everybody there. And but, so we've been making songs with him and stuff. We're trying to go out to Florida, shoot a video. If yeah. you guys need any Florida connections, bro, feel me. Um, My homeboy works directly with Rob Banks. You feel me? Uh, Supplies a lot of his clothes. Um, uh, yeah. No, that would be huge. Who else? Uh, like, a lot of shit goes on in Florida. Cause that would be huge. All the boys that I stayed out here with, like, when I first moved to L.A., um, you feel me? I'm not going to get too fed, but I had a little penthouse in downtown L.A. All them boys there were from Florida, though, and uh, a lot of connections were made from them, dude. Shout out Kill. Shout out St. Lawrence. Shout out Bino. You feel me? Shout out all them boys. But Kill? Yeah. K-I-L? Yeah, Killmore77. Seven seven. Oh, no. Nah. Oh wait, he's a. Dude, he, I, I follow that dude on Instagram. I think. Yeah, he. Wait. Yeah, 
Nah, but if you guys <laughs> if you guys need a video shot or anything, you guys should definitely hit up Kilmore though. Here, I gotta take a piss though. One second, guys. All right, y'all. We just came back from a little smoke break. I'm fucking faded as a. Oh. So we're gonna do a little music review. I just got some songs sent to my phone. So give me a second. I'm gonna get them loaded up on the computer, and then I will meet you guys back here in like two minutes. Once all this shit's playing, it's gonna be like zero minutes for y'all all right bet so we got the songs loaded up um we got chan here and flyboy on mw3 let's see what let's and see what, shy. and shy let's yeah. let's see what the hell's cracking i'm not affiliated That's Flyboy. Flyboy. I've never yeah. heard. I've never heard him before. That's actually. He's from Florida. He was a members only with X and Ski. So that's what you guys were talking about prior when you're speaking on Flyboy. Yeah, we linked. We haven't linked up with him, but he's. We've been making songs with him. For Type the last, shit. Like month. Yeah. Here, I'm gonna continue the song, but I just didn't know that fire shit, bro. Fuck with it. Phone way too fly. I like a lady. They call me Flyboy. They get on snap. Shawty be feeding for me a little addy. Touch on my body. That shit is a habit. Too much money, but all white janky. I'm big boss, little nigga. You a I'm the outside way in the back. Made the world move, disappear like magic. I can literally see you like in like you know like the drummer boy fucking like you know like the snare like just like like that would be so fire though bro like on some like creative shit that'd be fire as fuck that'd be funny for like a scene but Ah, uh, this is hard, bro. I fuck with this. This fire is for you. Ain't one piss park cross that you like a Christian. Ain't nobody better money on piss gas. I just shows in the back room. Get it out, throw it out, I'm in the bathroom. Yeah, got another thing to do. I said, this is strong. I got it. I said, you don't want it. Run it up. I don't want it for what I could buy. I'll just start it. I'll be a good guy. I could fool you with good. I'll be a good guy. I don't got no rap. Just cut your shot. And it bitch like rats. I'm in the alley. I'm with 99 bucks. Yeah, I'm inside every day. I'm a fool. And they bitch like it about me. This ain't nothing new. Alright, I can see what you're talking about now, how you're like, how you said you're really trying to focus on like those, you know, 10 second, really, really like catchy, catchy, catchy hooks. And like, that's not even like, there's like fucking 15, 10 second catchy ass yeah, hooks in there, exactly. you know what I mean? I just try to make every eight bars crazy. I think of like each eight bars. Just spaz on them. But now nah, that's cool. And um, I'm going to jump to shy too and give you your flowers as well in one second. But, and then, um, you know, the way that 
the way that the music sounds, especially like your mix, the way you know, the way that you talk on the mic, that the people here in like the more high pit, that's that's Chan for everybody fucking wondering. I be the, hitting that shit. The low voice. He just said, "I need to stop sounding like I fucking just took a Zan or some shit." But like that's <laughs> Chan that just is rapping. So yeah, the versatility definitely there. I can see it. I like it a lot. And um, yeah, what I was getting to with that though is just like yeah, fucking different as hell, bro. Like. You know, that's some shit that you would, you could, you were playing in your car and like your homeboy is going to look at you and be like, bro, what are you playing? But mm-hmm. deep down, they know that shit is so fucking hard, bro. Yeah. Period, yeah. bro. Like no cap. And then for shy, bro, to tie in what we were talking about too, before we still have uh, two songs to review as well for everybody listening. But um, to tie into what we were talking about before, like, you know, the plug side of shit, like then you, it's not a fucking, you know, that's not a plug fucking song, but. You know what I mean? And then you hear Shy come in on his chill shit, you feel me? On his smooth, like, vibed out, like, hitting yeah, his, yeah, I, hit, I, like, I hitting that, like, harmonic. I, I think that's the word I'm looking for. Yeah. Like, it's melodic. Yeah, melodic. That's but what I'm looking for. it's still fast, you know? Exactly. You know what I mean? And it's, but it makes you feel like, it's like going fast in a Porsche. You know what I mean? It's smooth, yeah, you feel yeah, me? Yeah. It's cool. Swerving around a few cars. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> so, yeah, no, I definitely. Yeah, fucking dog, bro. Yeah. <laughs> fucking shout out Q. But, um. Yeah, no, nah, I, I really, I fuck with that song. That's cool. Thank you. Definitely. Was, did it play in, like, full quality? Like, it sounded, like, muffled through my headphones. If it sounded muffled in the headphones, as I... Long, as I'll, long as it sounds normal for you, that's all that matters. I know how it sounds. And if, <laughs> if it sounds crazy, then um, fucking, you know, I can always... I'll, I'll fix it on the podcast so where you're all raw, bad. where the raw song is playing, and then you can f- also mix that shit one more time. I need to yeah. mix my part. <laughs> you both like, but yeah, my part is not. That's just how I recorded it, so I have to actually make that shit good. But it's fire because in my verse, Chan came in too, and we were like snapping and then back and forth and shit. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not gonna hold y'all, bro. Give me one second because I gotta piss again, bro. I'm sorry. Oh shit! Yeah, I'm, sorry, I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> we got like unlimited time at the studio, though. This studio. You didn't like these candy cones? <laughs> All right, we're right. back. And this is Raygun by J3 Mob, and then it's produced by Harz. So shout out Harz. I don't know who you are. I like how y'all incorporated the our horrors horrors producers, right? Yeah. I like how we incorporated the American Dad intro. That's just fine. Yeah, yeah, thank you. <laughs> I think yeah, that's the end of the song. I think I, I still need to cut it. I think it Horace made the beat, beat is just Horace, so hard. I'm Horace literally just vibing beat. to this shit. Horace made the beat, but Chan fucking added the intro. <coughs> oh, yeah. That was your idea? Yeah. We originally, yeah, yeah. Well, I think Harz actually did do it that time, but I did it I did it to a different song. Yeah, like we originally made before. that with a different song, but then like there was an original American Dad one, but then we were like, all right, we gotta like make a real song about this. Put it shit. on a better song. Yeah. <laughs> nah, good call though, bro. Definitely good call because everybody that fucking grew up, if you're, tw- I've been twenty. If you're 
twenty six and under, you know what the fuck American Girl, Dad is. I've been watching. That's I just started watching that a few months ago. I've been like on that. Sh- like I've been started. I watched that like since like Thanksgiving time. I've been watching American Dad, and that shit is so fucking funny. Because it's lunch, and bro, Roger is my favorite character. Bro, bro. This I just is- fuck with fucking that fool. Uh, that makes Steve? that shit. Seth MacFarlane. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. He's, he's he makes a, all that shit, bro. Him, family fucking genius, guy, bro. That, he's a goat, bro. Like, I need to meet that guy, bro. He's so good. Seth MacFarlane, bro. You feel me? Crank J3 Mob, they fuck with you, bro. <laughs> all right, but, um, yeah, so we got one more song, guys. You feel me? Celine. I think it's called Celine. Celine, Celine. and Selena. Yeah, this one's just me. I made this, like, a couple days ago. All right, bet. This is just a solo from Chen. <laughs> what? <laughs> some groovy shit this sounds like something that you would make from what you said that you grew up listening to and you're like yeah Michael Dyson goes crazy on the dance floor there are excuses I want you to myself sitting here looking stupid this is definitely uh, something different from what I was saying she took the keys to the cruise and they got like to know on the show hey I get you back making money every night Oh yeah, yeah, bro. Bro. Yeah, I'm gonna skip it for one second just because I want to say something. The like you said, y'all guys were like focusing mad like on visuals and shit, bro. Like I can legitimately see so much. Like we gotta get some music video shot, bro. When, you know when I mean? can you do it, bro? Let's do it. That's the only thing. <laughs> Fuck! I swear to God, I just gotta. Fi- I literally just gotta find some time, bro. And then you know what? We'll send you some songs to pick from. We'll make like five new ones like what, today or tomorrow, and then we'll send you like five. Today, God damn it, <laughs> y'all be Man, cranking out the rest of the night. Type shit, okay. Got to do today. I get to go home and eat some dinner though, and then I go. Home. We get. We gotta make music somewhere. Type shit. Okay, cool. But um, yeah, nah. I definitely want to get some visual shot for y'all's music because I can like I can I can see this shit as it's like. Fuck y'all, as y'all are fucking on the track, bro. Like, so. And just the same as, like, you helping us, we can help you whatever visions you have, bro. You can just, we can experiment with whatever the fuck you want. Too, okay, bro. bet. That, whatever you and want. I, bet. And that actually, bro, that's the type of shit that, you know, fucking, when a cameraman and a fucking director is going for an artist or shooting with an artist, you know what I mean? Like, that's the shit that we're looking for. If you want to recreate, like, scenes to, like, movies that you fuck with. Or Thank like, you! Like, yeah, like, that's, that's the shit. type of... That's what I'm saying. So whatever ideas you had yeah, previously, like whatever this. you want to make, like, bro, we're just going to be like, you just be like, meet, us, meet me here. We'll be like, you know what, let's do it. Like, because it's going to look fucking sick at the end of the day. Type bro. shit. That's just doing the work for us. Thank yeah, low key. Like, it's just like <laughs> helping us too, because it's like, we yeah, have no. our creative side too, but if like you have your shit, we're down to do it. Facts. Yeah, nah. And yeah, bro, that's fire. Uh, that's, and that's love too, bro. Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. We're going to get some shit cooking, bro, but... I'm gonna I'm gonna continue playing this song because fucking I just went off on a tangent. But yeah, no, nah, definitely we need to get some visuals out. Like I'm sorry, I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna skip. Like literally, like for this video, like I can like bro, like the way that this shit is, it's like like I don't know. I can see like on some like arcade shit. Like I don't even that know. Like so you know hard. what I mean? Like go karts. Like just some like you know what I mean? Like the fucking bumper cars. Like just some mad That'd like real fire, like right. goofy but poppy type of like cool ass like. You, you, know, could, you could shoot this. You I, don't, I don't have anyone shooting this video yet. Like and then I could be just low key. Like a, I could just be the dude filling the gas when you pull up to the station, and I give you some <laughs> gas, and you're like, "Thank you." And <laughs> keep on your video, and they're like, "Yo, that's fucking shy, bro. What the fuck?" As soon as people hear this and it, like they see like the dude who's making them like bro this white dude is hard as fuck bro like no cap they're like what the fuck no cap too deep, got the gang with one hand on 7 11. Okay, my wrist on safe gang, and I fish it like heaven. How much better could it be? They be raising my temper when they be looking at me. Got a bitch, got several, okay, they fuck it with me. We be raising the temper, to be better than that. Definitely a more popular song. I'm probably gonna go. I'm gonna go.
but need me with a full fight on cars Gotta shit my back, stay right, I'm off it Just give me up all night, it's off it Spending all my money, it's tight, it's awesome Dick got a bitch, man, it's ain't like Lady, they're making it, money from shit on the side Walk around, I'm smoking on tree Yes, it's rock shots, we born up late I'll get too deep, cut the gang look wild And I'm 7-Eleven, I'll get my wrist on circuit And I fish it like heaven, how much better could it be? They be raising my temper when they be looking at me I got a bitch, got several, I'll get it, fuck it with me We be raising the temper, do we burn in that heat? But me, may well full fight on car shit Gotta shit my back, stay right, I'm off it Just give me up all night, it's off it Spending all my money, it's tight, it's awesome Dick got a bitch, man, tight But lately been making it money from shit on the side I don't want your excuses, I want you to myself Sitting here like it's stupid, I don't want no one else Take my heart and you bruised it, only thing by yourself She took the keys to the cruise, I think I left them on the shelf Fire Fire. Definitely different, different, or definitely a different side of Chan. First first time hearing, like, the more, like, poppy, like, funky, you know what I mean, type of music. That's that's cool, though. I fuck with it. Gotta keep it versatile. Yeah, for sure. There's that, bro, there's a, there's a lane for all this shit, you know what I mean? <clears throat> but, um, yeah, and you guys are low-key creating it. You know, there's, you know, there's definitely people that fucking have rapped fast before, you know, but, you know, I mean, all this shit, I like it a lot, bro. It's very Thank unique. You. Thank you, bro. Um... But yeah, so basically, you know, that's just a, a taste for everybody listening. You know, that's you know some of the. One more. Send one more. Yeah. Oh yeah, he but, texted you. So oh shit! One. All right, guys. So we got the video pulled up. This is shy. Um, this is a single by him called Human. This is some visuals as well. I'm just gonna pop it up right here, so you guys can see what's going on. Dude, no way. You got the. Is that the PlayStation? Yeah. Two? <laughs> I fuck with it. Bored, I just sit in my room. Bored, I take chance, I just go to the mall. And she only want me if we had a view. I'm smoking tall, I'm just a human. I done did the whole song with a few clicks. You looking good in a few flicks. She thought I must have been one of them cool kids. People changing up, I don't give a fuck. I'm really off of that shit. Water on me, it's an Aquaman fit. Playing shit on my mind like the Oculus Rift. I woke up, hit up where I left off. And my pockets have been defending like Rick Ross. Everybody laughing and they thought this shit was a sick call. Money coming in from out the doubt that I was trying to fuck with me. Turn around and hit up. Is that a sweater? Is that a sweater? Smoking in the yeah. joint, Hard, bro. I'm not in downtown, I'm in Malibu Blood in the mirror, told myself I'm proud of you I took my shoes off and walked on the beach Showing a guard to dinner with me Dumb bitch, hey Smoke inside it though, but I'm not popping no beans It's a lot of throat that she been giving to me I'm finna blow this shit up, no tongue clamps She gon' live my balls like hard can All my part of this shit, that's bad plan Go to crash through it, all of his brakes slam Chop and eat you up, you like a ham sandwich I done turn this shit up to the bass jam She gon' fuck on my mind, till my brain panic Hotel, uh, bored, I just sit in my room When I take drugs, I just go to the mall And she only want me if we had a view I'm smoking tall, I'm just a human I done did the whole song with a few clicks You looking good, in a few I flicks that was I must have been one of them cool kids People He said I'm only I'm human fuck. I'm really off of this shit Water on me, it's an Aquaman fit Playing tricks on my mind like the Oculus Rift I woke up, picked up where I left out And my pockets have been defending like Rick Ross Everybody laughing and thought that shit was a sitcom Money coming in from out the doubt that I was trash She was fucking with me, turned around and hit her on the mattress Smoking in the joint, I know who is that a pet I'm not in downtown, I'm in Malibu Blood in the mirror, told myself I'm proud of you I took my shoes off and walked on the beach She on the guard to do I'm not in downtown, I'm in Malibu, that's fine, bro Make it sadder though, but I'm not popping no beans It's a lot of throat that she been giving to me Nah, the visual was hard, bro Whoever shot that That was like, that was like earlier That was like a year ago, probably <laughs> I mean, it's not like, you feel me, some Vivo shit It's, it's cool, that's cool though that's definitely That was fine. like, yeah, that, that was like it's not even like mixed or anything That was ours, just like, it ours. was just fire So we just dropped that shit And we just made a video to it when we were out there so we got so it was actually shot by Harz. Yeah, yeah Harz is a producer. He shot it on a high eight camera. It's like an old film camera. And so then Evan, Evan edited edited some of it, and then also Dejan edited some of it. Oh yeah. So at shot by Evan, um, directed by edited um, by High Four Days dot MP4. Yeah, it's Dejan. So yeah, nah, definitely cool video. I fuck with it. Dope song, bro. You feel me? Some yeah, catchy shit as well, bro. Just, like, it's like a year ago, but it's like, hell yeah, I fuck with that too. That's why. That's all I was like, all right, send that shit. Nah, definitely, and it's gonna be cool too. Like we got we got a little visualizer now too, just to see like what the motion is. You feel me? So wait, listen to this. Wait. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah. The first one was crazy. <laughs> You're gonna be talking when you watch the replay. You guys were just talking, and I did the craziest. It was like that's somebody small, somebody's just gonna zoom in on this fool that's fucking breaking his <laughs> neck, bro. <laughs> <clears throat> Crazy, but yeah, <clears throat> god damn, bro. I swear that bong sent my ass to fucking Pluto and smacked my ass to Saturn, and then I'm back on Earth. But so, yeah, that was the music review, y'all. You feel me? That's uh, you know what I mean. You guys got to see 
fucking one end of the scale all the way to the other end of the scale from versatility. Um, yeah. So what's coming up in the future, bro? It's 2024. You know, it's like, what is it? January 4th. It's like the fucking fourth mm. day of the new year. So what's coming up for you guys? We'll start off with Shy. So what do you what do you got planned? You know what I mean? Or we can start with Chan, whichever one of you guys want to pop in first. You can start with Chan, bro. Okay, but... We, and then, it's, yeah. It's mostly just J3 stuff together. And we're doing a bunch of collabs with different artists, like um, Montana 99 we talked about. I mean, the interview got deleted, but yeah, shout out Montana. <laughs> Um, yeah, shout out Montana. Flyboy, obviously. Shout out both them boys. You feel yeah. me? Y'all guys go check them out. Yeah, got we got stuff coming with a lot of people. We're just. I'm gonna take off these words. headphones real quick. Some with Super Mario. Super yeah. Mario, bro, is Luigi. It's like, no, let me stop. That was <laughs> fucking. He's a go-to fuck. go <laughs> producer, bro. Yeah, he's crazy. And then a bunch of shit with Hars. Yeah. And just just a bunch of new collabs. Yeah, definitely a bunch a, of new collabs. Trying to get that, music videos. Just up the content as a full. You have another music video out right now, or four months four months ago too. I just dropped one yesterday, a solo one. Which one are you talking about? Two seconds by Shy. Yeah, this is it. Oh, yeah. Can that's I play this real quick? Just yeah. I have to put the headphones back on. Right. Play the video. Okay, but you have to play the video of Chan that just dropped yesterday, right after. All right, yeah, we're gonna yeah, do thirty just, seconds of crazy. two more seconds, and then we're gonna do. No, you gotta do like a minute of each, though. All right, we'll rock paper scissors <laughs> shoot. A minute of each song, or thirty seconds. I was out in Canada for that shit. Yo, this fool's in a fucking simulation right now, bro. What the fuck? The green screen in the back just moves it. This is like some, this is different too than this some sad bullshit. Not two more seconds. Not two more seconds. Not two more seconds. This out of wild words. Yeah, see, I'm trying to cope, but I'm still hurt. Go. Using this bar as a filler. Been close to broke, but this smoke got me still too. Fucking with coke, gotta keep the shit real. These videos are like, um, <clears throat> it gives me like that bones ass thing. I like it. The fact that you were at the very end of that long cut off, just like at the very end of it. Oh shit, I was supposed to only listen to 30 seconds. It's so good, bro. So I'm uh, like, I genuinely uh, fuck with y'all's music. Like, I swear to God, bro. Like, this is actually good. I swear to God, I was supposed to stop this shit fucking 30. Like, you know, it's good, bro. Some, like, ambient, like, this is good. That's what I'm saying. That's, like, the bag I'm trying to get into where it's, like, because I fuck with this type of shit. Ah, this is cool, bro. This is actually going on the playlist, bro. No cap. No cap. Hell yeah. That was fire. Hell yeah. That was fire, bro. That's some shit, man. Like, that's some shit that's... Bro, I can listen to that for, like, on repeat. That's what I'm saying. If I, I'm trying to get into that bag right now. Okay, like, aside from this, just, like, just us talking, but, like... One second. Yeah, like... No, you don't have to cut it or anything. Oh, but you... Yeah, word. Like, I'm trying to fucking make it so, like, I can make a bunch of, like... Chill ass songs that are like also just like hard and like turned up at the same time where you just want to smoke to them at like night and just like vibe, you know? Literally, bro, because that's some shit that you can just turn on. Like, and even if you like had a bad day, bro, you want to drive or some shit. Because, like, if you didn't know me, if I didn't know y'all, like, bro, you feel me? Like, I would hear that shit playing on SoundCloud, it would be instant. 
boom on the playlist, bro. Yeah. And you know I mean, nigga, I'll yeah. be driving, doing fucking some Uber Eats late at night, probably fucking yeah. smoking some weed, like you just said, bro. Cool, no cap, bro, because I fuck with that shit when <laughs> I'm driving at night. Bro. That shit I made, and did I make that in Canada? I think, right? Yeah. That shit was so lit. I made that shit in fucking Jed's, not Jed's, in Akia's basement, and then... Is it the Sunset Boulevard, right? Yeah. All right, that shit is hard. Oh, well, let me throw it back on the headphones real quick. Taylor All right. actually edited it. And then... Yeah, and then we got... Okay, so this is... So then we got Chan Pricks... Or Preeks. Chan, ah, Chan Pricks? Chan Pri. Pri. I'm fucking burnt, dude. I swear, yeah. I'm a burn, bro. Not everybody does that. You're good. So, music video visualizer, let's get it. Look what you're doing the chamber. <laughs> Ooh, the angle. Oh, this was fire, yo. This is cool as fuck. Hold up. This is with Miles. Uh, Shot this on a uh, black magic. I can definitely do some shit like this for you, bro. Like I can do this shit for you. If you if this is the type of quality you're going, I can I can do it. We can we can do some shit. Like on some running gun shit, we can get it. Like, bro, you feel know I me? Mean? Like you can do this shit anywhere. Yeah, like you know what I mean. Like this is some shit we don't gotta sit and do a treat for. You know, like we can just. Like we got the studio in Sometimes all you need is just visuals. But the thing, I just was, um, my bad, I'm going to I got ADHD. Nah, literally, bro. Like, literally, fam. Like, fuck what, like, legitimate. Like, fuck what anybody <laughs> says. Nah, bro. You feel me? Bro moment. You know what I mean? But yo, like, what anybody says, like, if it's anything, like, negative, like, bro, this fucking dude, like, you know what I mean, bro, like, yo, you're cool as fuck, bro, like, this is, like, this is some cool shit, like, you feel me, like, yo, y'all, y'all are, y'all got your own shit going on. Appreciate you. And, like, literally, like, you're speaking it, too, like, you're just, like, you feel me, you feel me, you're not trying to be somebody else, like, you're just fucking chan. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but like I, I knew it was still hard as fuck and I hate it. I just wanted you to fucking learn that shit. We were almost a J three song. Man, shout out it took too long. Shout out on uh, Neiman yeah. Neiman Taylor. Yeah, Neiman Taylor. Ne- yeah, Neiman Taylor P three. At yeah, Neiman Taylor P three. Yeah, he shout goes out. crazy, bro. He does everything. Shout out uh can we play Lady Gaga? Alright, this is the last song we're gonna play y'all, and then we're gonna get back into you know the podcast format type shit. Yeah, yeah, this video is crazy. Oh, what the fuck's going on? Sorry, y'all. We have a short laggage. Shout out Kobe, <laughs> bro. R.I.P. For real. No, for real. And I've been a rider since the day I was born. <laughs> Yo. Hold up, load me up, bro. Hold up. I got some gas too. Pause. <laughs> load up the bomb. Not load me up. <coughs> <coughs> the fucking cheese or <coughs> the yellow on yellow is fire.
We shot that shit like quick, like in only a few hours. Just on some random shit, but I know where that that Kobe thing is like right in isn't that downtown LA? No, it's in it was in the valley, low key. Oh, never mind. Oh. Sorry. There's like there's hella Kobe there's hella murals. Shit, yeah. So let me just fucking chill. <laughs> I might have took false ass. Damn. And I've been a rider since the day I was born, bitch. I said in my new pajamas, I ain't snug enough. <laughs> So, oh shit, this was shot by Neiman Taylor too. Yeah, he shot that shit. Yo, shout out Neiman Taylor, bro. If you ever want to collab on some shit, hit me up. You feel me? I got. I that got was Prod Jed. Prod Jed, bro. Jed is a goat. He'd be making all types of fucking weird ass beats, bro. <clears throat> and that's what I hear from y'all too. Like the fucking the production or not? I, yeah, you got the produ- the production. You guys like it's are coming crazy, with is literally some bro. Some, it's always crazy. It sounds like some alien shit. It's like, yo, what the you fuck? Know, more of these. You want I some of these? Water. If I eat so, those, my boy, I will be we have, fucked. We have the best producers Why? in the I'll underground, be. bro. I swear we have the best producers. We have, <laughs> we have, we have, we have, he was like, but I will take some. Yeah, we have people, we have producers from the industry fucking, fucking with us, like a couple of them, like Super Mario. Um, and, for fucking, people, and for people that don't know, like, so what's some, like, what are some of the accolades, Super Mario? And, you know, as you're speaking about these producers, like. He produced for Drake, Uzi. Cardi. Oh, this shit, like, he produced like I didn't know that. Watch what's next for Drake. Even for like DC the Dawn and shit, I was fucking with all that shit. You know, like the tag, like, um, <coughs> wait, what the fuck is it? Like, let's go, Mario. Yeah, let's go, Mario. Or the Mario. Um, that goes back to Mario. COVID, bro, because COVID, listen, listen about this. This goes back all the way to COVID because in COVID, like, Silly Watch by Uzi. Yeah. Eternal a take dropped and Loki that was fire like that was good as fuck like that was perfect timing because everyone was just bumping shit by themselves and that shit ran the fuck up like that silly watch song when I heard that tag I was like oh shit no way like Super Mario's on here so oh okay watch me right down I'm just for everybody wondering who Super Mario is I didn't even fucking notice that's lit that's fire bro Y'all are probably saying this like, yo, this motherfucker has no reaction to me saying fuck. Like, that's lit. That's cool as fuck. He's that's- believed in us for a while, too. It's been, like, a year now. He's one of the first, like, real, like, figures to fuck with us. Like, in the th- yeah, before, like, Ski Mask or, like, any, like, anybody followed us, he was, like, one of the I didn't even know people. that either. But the thing is, like, I, like, respectfully, bro, like, the fact, like, I'm not like I'm like I'm in the music scene. You feel me? Like I have homeboys. You feel me? I grew up boom boom, but it's like as of right now, it's like you know, I really have like a certain group of people that like I'm fucking with, and those are you know, that's the music that I'm listening to. And yeah, I branch out. Yeah, you know what I mean. But as of right now, it is what it is, just because the music scene is so saturated. Kind of what we were talking about beforehand. Like there's a lot of people doing the same shit. You know what I mean? That's why I fuck with you guys. You know that's why I fuck with you know the artists that I do have on here. Yeah, because all these guys got something different to bring to the table. Mm-hmm. But with Super Mario and what I was uh, getting at before that shit is half these people that like motherfuckers bring up. Like my reaction is dead ass genuine as fuck. Like, bro, I most of the time I don't know who you're talking about. You know what I mean? Yeah. And when I do figure out these fucking things, like it makes me happy. You know what I mean? I'm glad. You know what I mean? Like that's cool as fuck, bro. Like you know what I mean? Like mm. the fuck, bro. That's dope. And I'm glad to see, you know. You probably know Flyboy Tarantino. Exactly. If you, like, paid attention no, to, like, X and Ski. Look is, up Flyboy Tarantino. Like, I feel like you know his face at bare minimum. I, 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 maybe not, actually. But Tarantino, I must just spell that. you were into crazy. the same shit that I was in. Let me see this real quick. I have to play like, a little bit. I'm going to, like, I'm going to skip this because they're going to try to fucking You're good. copyright my ass. This is not his music video, bro. This is a fucking. This is the movie Scar, or scary movie. <laughs> Here, baby. Go and show him some shit. You can't tell me 
I don't know this guy. So please don't waste all of mine. Got me feeling crazy. I don't know. I don't know him. He, he, he's crazy, like independent. I, I found out about, I found out about him from like X and Ski. Was, like you know when X and Drop, X and Ski, or no, it was the members only tapes on like X's account. But all those like tapes are crazy, bro. Like it's like they, a whole collective on it, and they all just made songs. Like I think it was right after X died. No, it was yeah. still when X was. No, it was the, right, no, there the, was the one, the one, one the one that it, they dropped after. They had a, like a few sad songs on there that were like really fucking crazy. Type shit. Yeah, no, I never, I, I honestly, I mean, I probably have seen this fool before, but he's not familiar. He's not ringing any bells, but definitely, you feel me? He's a legend, for real. He, he was part of that shit. He was part of the reason why we rap, honestly. And not, and, yo, know, fl- shout out Flyboy, bro, you feel me? Bro, shout out you. Shout out Everything's you, gang. Everything's coming full circle right now for us. It's like, those are like our idols, everybody, <laughs> in that scene. And you said Ski Mask? He followed us, like, he's he, he DM'd us, like, once. We're just waiting on the next step on that right now, honestly. But we're hoping for the best. I went to one of the music videos, so that was turn. But I'm trying just to, I'm trying to lock in for real. Literally, bro, just keep on dropping music because you yeah, feel me. Niggas are seeing yeah, what's going seeing on already. It. That's all that matters. Oh shit, bro! This is why I hate wearing these fucking headphones, bro. But um, yeah, nah. Y'all guys are lit as fuck. Thank you. So enough glazing, enough fucking glazing this shit like a damn donut. Yeah. Um. Yeah, we can hop back into, you know, just future shit for 2024 because, you know, y'all guys did just drop, like, a collab project. Not super recent, but recent as fuck, low-key, past couple months. So that's all new music you guys can go check out. But for the future tense, what's going on? Um, We got a song with Montana dropping sometime this month, a song with Flyboy MW3 dropping sometime <laughs> either this month or next month. That song Ray Gun sometime in there. Let's get a date on some of these drops, bro, so we can get these viewers flooded in and fucking clicking this shit. Hold up, I'm gonna do a. That's funny, huh? We're gonna do a pause because the camera just stopped. Um, I'm gonna give the floor to J3 Mob, Chan, and Shy just so they can, you know, plug the last few things because we're gonna we're gonna end this. That's episode number 25 for you guys. So Chan, Shy, what do you guys gotta say? Uh, shit. I mean. Thank you for having us on the lunch, lunch and media. Thank you guys for coming. Podcast, we're in the lunchbox. Uh, we got big shit coming this year. Ton of collabs, ton of content coming every couple of weeks. We're going to be dropping. Even every couple of days, we'll be we're dropping on our individual sound clouds. Uh, shout out all the fucking producers and Planet Smiley. What are you? Yeah, just big shit coming. Everybody go follow that shit up there. He's going to yeah. put it up there, I think. <laughs> I'm putting it up there for yeah, sure. Yeah, hell yeah. Go f- click that shit. <laughs> Thank you for having yeah, us. Everyone. For sure, man. Shout Thank you, guys. Jed, shout out Harsh. Shout out Unji. Shout out No Caution. Calamani. Lone Star. Everybody, man. T Dog. Akia. Daytona. Daytona. Fire, bro. Everybody, man. Everybody in Planet Smiley. Chalky. Sebastian. And yeah. we didn't. We didn't get to get into too much of Planet Smiley, but that's for part two, y'all. So yeah, stay we, tuned. We're, we're gonna, gonna be have a whole interview with everyone. Yeah, now everybody. That's shout out here. Jacob. <laughs> We're gonna be following the the whole process with J Three Mob, you know, Planet Smiley, and your solo careers as you know you guys are growing um, as artists. So, but that wraps up episode number twenty twenty or number twenty twenty five, number twenty five, uh, and yeah, yeah, let's get it with J Three yeah. Mob episode twenty five. Lunch and media, J Three Mob. Yeah, thank wow. you guys, for real. Thank you. Hey, thank you. I that's a you, bro. that's a wrap. Appreciate y'all. Peace.